Hey gang, uh, welcome to the Daily Message. And uh, I want to talk about today, uh, everyone takes a different path. Uh, in the past, I've spoken about uh, the keys to success. And so those keys were to be consistent, persistent, resilient, eat fear like it's ice cream, and have a mentor. Uh, I've also in the past spoken about uh, you are who you associate with. And that if you emulate success, you're more than likely going to have success. I think the other thing to be mindful of is the third component, which I'll talk about today, is carving your own path. Uh, many, many paths are carved uh, on the road to success, whatever success uh, you deem to be seeking, uh, whether it is a business goal, personal goal, relationship goal, all of those have markers of success. And I would hit a pause here and a little caveat is that if you don't have a goal towards uh, something, it's very difficult to know what you're uh, trying to achieve. Uh, so this particular one today is talking about the various paths to uh, success. Uh, it kind of reminds me of a parable story that talks about uh, open sea sailboat racing. And uh, they all, all the boats, say there's eight boats and they all start at the same starting buoy. Uh, this is open water and they all take off. And for about the first mile or so, they're all side by side. They're all kind of char uh, charting their own course. And then as the race goes on, because it's a multi-mile race, as the race goes on, you can actually start seeing the boats spread and they veer out and they take off uh, towards other uh, aspects of the open water. Each captain has his or her own uh, course that they've charted. And they literally, for the length of the almost the entire race, they disappear from one another. Can't even they can't see each other. And along about the last couple, two or three miles of the races, they're all heading towards and steaming towards or sailing towards the end buoy, which is the finish line. They all start to come back into view because there's this component then of drafting and finding calm water and the right winds that all take place. And they all end up ultimately crossing the finish line within seconds of each other uh, to achieve their goal. Well, life is kind of like that, that we all have different paths that we take. And I think the big thing to remember is it's okay to take a different path than someone else. It's okay to take a path that uh, hasn't been taken before. Uh, my wife used to tell all three of our boys, guys, the extra mile is never crowded. And so that's a that's sage advice. So. As you're going through your goals and you're seeking out your paths to success, remember that it's okay sometimes to take a uh, road less traveled, to take a path that's different as long as you stay focused on the goal. And at the end of the day, regardless of the path you take, if you stay focused on it and you work hard and you apply all those principles I've spoken about in the past, uh, more than likely you're going to hit that goal of success, whatever that particular goal is, and then you regroup and set your sights on another. So remember, it's okay to take a different path. Don't let anyone uh, steer you, no pun intended, wrong from that path and uh, chart your own course. So with that, there's the message. Hope you guys are continuing to have a great week and uh, we'll talk again to you soon. Take care.